Hey, what is up, all you gamers? My name is ZDGamer16, and today we're back for another episode of Bloodborne. Yes, that is the name. So, in the last episode, we got to Bergenworth, and also fought the boss that has like three bosses in one. So, yeah. Also, we're fighting this thing right now, so we're gonna open the door with this key, and we're gonna run for our lives. So, yeah, pretty fun. If I do say so myself. We're gonna shoot them off. And they're dead. Once we jump in anyway. Uh. Now this is a boss, but yeah, we killed this thing, so I'm just gonna take that, thanks. It's honestly not even worth it. But if you've ever seen a fight against that enemy, then you know it's like basically hell. So, it's Wish to Reawaken, and we're not actually going to be fighting this boss, because I said we'll fight two bosses, and I technically sometimes count that hunter as a boss, but I forgot we actually missed one boss that we probably should do right now, because he'll disappear after. Well, for a little while, anyway, he'll disappear. So we're gonna go beat him first. Let's do this. When all is melted in blood, and all is reborn, I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's actually get levels before anything, because that's probably more important. What is it you desire? 29. Do I want to get to 30 health? Kinda do. Or I can get to 25. Nope. It's 4 levels. <laughs> Jeez. Alright, yeah, we'll get to 29 vitality. And just spend the rest on blood vials. Like a good person would. Now what else we got here? Am I using this? I don't think I am. What we got anyway? Not a lot of stuff. But let's go check the insight shop, because we haven't checked that in a while from what I can remember. And I went a bit too far, but we can still make it here. Fire paper. Nice. Okay. Uh, yeah. We have no fire paper? What the heck happened to it? Oh no, we have one. Why the heck do we only have one? What happened to all our others that mm, we probably didn't have, I guess? Wow, I mean, nine bolt paper. Okay then. Well, we are going to go over to. The Fogging Gall. All right, so yeah, so I'm just gonna talk more about Last of Us because I just want to, well, I talked about it in the last episode, and that was pretty fun, I guess. Also, we're gonna have to run for our effing lives, kind of. Better run, better run, I don't know when the next boss is. Okay, run. Nope, we ain't fighting you. We're not fighting you guys either. How's it going? Goodbye. See you never. I wanna meet ya. Okay, so we can summon someone for this boss, which you might be able to see that. It's basically just bones. Yeah, it looks like just bones anyway. Now it turned into a bit of hair. And as I was saying, The Last of Us, I played that a lot. Like, that was my first kind of like multiplayer shooting game. And I loved that. I played it so flipping much. And then one day I was just like, yeah, 
You know, it's not. It's probably around the time Overwatch came out. Oh, hi there, buddy. No, I know you have a bit of anger issues, not gonna lie. Ow. Ow. Buddy. Jesus. I had enough health for this boy. Hey, you wanna go for the legs when fighting this dude? You should have aimed for the legs. Ow. That's pretty good music. Are you kidding me? I missed. Jesus. Oh god. Just gonna stay away from that. Let's go, buddy. Oh god. Thank you, Dark Souls. Yeah, this is kind of a difficult boss. Because you can get locked into some combos. Ow. Jeez. Okay then. Electricity. Yes. I know you love that kind of shit, bro. Okay, I don't know what the heck just happened there, but I think I broke all his legs at once, so I'll take it, but... Jeez. Okay, and he ran away. Main thing charged up. What? How did I miss that? Oh, thank you, Dark Souls. Even though this isn't Dark Souls, I'm gonna keep saying that. No. Ow. Jeez. Dark Beast, no! As a family, can't do this to me. I know you probably have a family too, but still. Jeez, that monster, literally. Dark beast, you beast. <laughs> That's not funny at all. But we killed him. Yeah, that just happened. Well. Now we can go through here and literally do nothing. Because this leads back to... Wow! Old Yarnum! That, that, that is kind of crazy. Why the hell do we go back to Old Yarnum? We already went to this area before, but... Like... What the fudge? <laughs> Yarnum is supposed to be an unseen village. But literally it's right over here. How did no one from all Old Yarnum see it? Like, what? Well, whatever, I guess. Now we're back here, and this girl's sleeping on the job, as usual. What is it I desire? Well, you see. That, that is what I desire. Oh my gosh, I forgot the most important thing I could have talked about. The Flash is back. The TV show The Flash. I watched it, uh, Wednesday. I think. I don't remember, honestly. But, yeah. So, also, a show called Super Grill. I mean, no, yeah, that came back, I guess, to season 5 to that. Arrow is coming back this week, which is <laughs> not really the week that this comes out. Because I don't know when the heck this episode is going out. But where were we? Oh, yeah, Bergenworth. So... Huh. What was that saying? <laughs> Five second memory, by the way. Yeah, so Batwoman, which is a new show, came out. Uh, I watched Titans, season two, a couple episodes of that. The Titans, I would recommend. Really good show, actually. It's, mm, it's pretty similar to, actually, the CW shows. And... Oh my gosh, bug boy. 
anything else I can grab down here? Nope. But the Flash first episode, I really liked it. The villain looks like he's gonna be good, and I know he's gonna only be for part of the stuff. Now we talk to it. Oh god. Boy, come over here. I dare you. I double dare you. Jeez. I want, I want my health back, bro. This is Sparta. Give me blood bottles, I swear. Okay. Well, as I was saying, this is my dad, secretly. Now, we have to bring her out of his pen. Fuck! And he's not dead. What the fudge? <laughs> he's apparently a really sick grandpa. So, we just killed him and we got the eye rune, which makes us have a better chance of finding stuff. Yay. So we're gonna plop on in here. And as I was saying, um, oh yeah, so there's another show I watched called Lucifer, and apparently he might be in the infinite, uh, in, what? In the Crisis on Infinite Earths crossover, which, what the fudge? <laughs> this is gonna be really, a really weird crossover if they're gonna have the devil in the fudging show. I'm just saying, bro. Also, well, let's use bolt paper, since it's actually weak to bolt paper. Now, we have a perfect chance to just pop him in the butt. We're gonna do that. Fuck! That did nothing, what? Ow! Okay, I'm with that. Yeah, spiders are powerful, by the way. <laughs> I'm not sure if you've heard, but spares can one-shot you. Okay. <laughs> Jeez. This is gonna be annoying. Just saying, this is one of my least favorite uh, bosses. Yeah. I hate fighting him. Sometimes he's easy, other times he's a piece of shit. Yeah, you like me saying shalite, whatever the heck that means? As I just said, I hear a garbage truck outside, and it's being really effing loud. Alright, we're going to go back in here solo, as you do, you know, and we're going to just jump on in. Now what we want to do first is actually take on the spiders, the baby spiders, because they're pieces of crap. And once you get rid of them, you're going to be able to easily go for the big boss. So, they're two hit with this weapon, thankfully. Yeah, there's, their face is like, basically a shield. Just like the papa, or mama, or whatever the fudge that thing is. Also, when they stick their head into the ground like that, when they do their headbutt thing, that just means they're, like, gonna die. They take extra damage, and they just deceased. We want to punch him in the butt. Punch this one in the butt, too. Maybe a couple more in the butt. Yeah, okay, punch this last one in the butt, and we're fine. Alright. And this big-ass spider is just still running away, like a piece of crap. You know, as you do. But what we want to do is hit him with the big shots. Now we don't want them running away, so we're gonna hit him again. And he ran away. Now where'd he go? Now we can actually attack. Oh, what the fudge. Oh, great, more spiders, my favorite. Thank you, Dark Souls. Yeah, he's using a summon the gods move, a uh, meteor strike. Jeez, bro, stop spamming. It's spamming moves, man. It's not loud. Hi there. How you doing, Spider? Oh my god. Yeah, this one has a uh, fish move. 
me as that. So that's kind of scary. Yeah, I'm more scared of these baby spiders, honestly. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh yeah, there's also that. Yep, and I'm probably gonna die. Aren't I? Oh great. Let me run, let me run, let me run. Oh, fudge, of course I get locked onto him and die. <sighs> it's a good thing you can't run when you're locked on, am I right? Yeah, we're probably gonna have a lot of attempts against this. Against this. I might go into the next episode, because I don't have the time. Big sad. Alright, well, we go again, boys. And honestly, we might want to use Beast Blood Pellets. I'm not sure if they work with this weapon. They probably do, but if they don't, then fudge. That's a big sad. Oh, good thing the bug got stuck on the wall. That's nice. That's nice of them. Now, I don't know where my echoes are gonna be, my blood echoes. That's the biggest issue here. I guess there was only 3,000 and once we re beat the boss, we'll probably not care for it anyway. So yeah, but still. Hi there. Ow. Yeah, kill some bugs. Get the bug spray, boys. How's it going, buddy? If you know what's good for you, they'll die. God damn it. I did even less damage. Great. At least you can't spawn into the very next spot. Yet. Oh great, and he's using Senum of the Gods. Or Meteor Strike or Worm the Fudge. Oh great. Hi there players, how are you on this fine jolly good day? Oh shit. Ah. You actually take more damage when you roll, so I probably shouldn't have done that. Oh, great. More meteors. It'd probably be much easier to just summon someone. But, we need summon enough in here. Okay then. We might need to. Holy crap. Now, where is this son of a duck? Over here. Oh, great. I swear to God, if I die to this thing again... Okay. Oh, thank you guys all for watching. Oh, jeez. You know what? Yeah, we're gonna summon people. This boss is a pain in my arse. <sighs> and I truly do not like it. So yeah. I swear to god, if this bug is chasing me. No, it's not. Good. I heard some suicide bugs, though. Okay, we're gonna summon this guy, and that's really all. We're gonna wanna wait for him to. From the bell's timber, a bell ringing duck has appeared. Let's go, boys. And girls. And ducks. Don't forget about the ducks. Yeet! 
And my gal. Oh, hey, it's my souls. Why the heck did they spawn in here this time? Alright, well, let's get rid of the spiders first. Hopefully Damien or Moonsis knows to do that. Is he just staying there? Oh god. Is it glitch? Okay, never mind. I was gonna say there's a glitch where they just fudging sit around doing nothing for a bit. Like most of the time actually. Alright, teamwork, yeah. Alrighty. Okay, killing off all the spiders in the world. Okay, get the bolt paper ready. And it's time to hit this guy in the butt. Let's get closer to me, please, and thank you. No. Bad boy. Fudge. I didn't get the damage off on him. Alright, so, while the spiders are possibly distracted by Damien Amensis, I am going to get killed. Like I said, but Damien Amensis is going to fucking die probably. I don't know why I'm saying his name so weirdly. Oh, look at that in the water. No, bad spiders. Okay. Now, why are all the spiders separating from him? I so is Mensis dying? Or Damon? Or Arm the Fudge? Alright, we're running in circles now, because this is the only strategy to this. There is no strategy. Jesus! Okay then. Alright, well. Now yeah, that's an actual thank you guys all for watching. Yeah, we are gonna fight that guy in the next episode. Because he sucks. Alright, well, as I said. Thank you guys all for watching. Hope you enjoyed me dying like or something times to this boss. And I will see you guys in the next one. Good.